it's almost uh, louder than the start of the national. They're at the first now and all over the first safety. Eight flights of hurdles to jump in this speed championship, and it's brown lad as expected. The bowls are locked. They've got a long run now before they sort themselves out and come towards flight two. Prominent profile, Wither or Witch, Ho Invader on the outside. Perfect venue is running fast. Uh, the Grey Art Tyler is taking a prominent position early on uh, for the Anfield Ombres, and then behind them, Copper Shell. Or La Loire in a good position. At this stage, the favourite Cardinal Hill sits in a midfield role on the inside, and uh, Joe Mack is tracking him in the same ownership. Come down towards the second, then. They really are going lickety split. And it's Brown Lad, what a good jump. The uh, wave of second place comprises Wither or Witch, Ho Invader. On the outside, Silent Reigns runs well, prominent profile the inside. And then our sailor, all La Loire, followed by Arctic Fancy. On the outside, Sansaru, and then uh, Garden Hill and Joe Mack, and all gone. And Colonel Jaeger and Treasure Chest, and then Ricardo, followed by Copper Shell. The fly is the three last, two last. Here's Rathborn Prince, and as they spin away from the turn, it's Carlis Crest who's last. So they wreck their way out towards the flight number three, and it's still Brown Lad that leads. Brown Lad has the edge here. Two Wither or Witch on the inside, and then showing in third is Ho Invader on the outer is Silence Reigns, and the Grey Altala is uh, making ground two. Come down towards flight three. Brown Lad in front, then the uh, fly was slightly hampered passing the stands, well down at that point, and the two McManus horses, Joe Mack and Cardinal Hill, both held up in midfield. Down the back straight they go, Altala the Grey on the outside, Brown Lad towards the inside. Ho Invader is right there too with Wither or Witch not far away and Arctic Fancy and towards the outside of these San Suru, the German Raider. Silence Reigns is right up there too. Red and white colours into third place as they clear another that was very untidy at that. Carly's quest is well adrift at the moment as they continue down the back straight. Right out the back also Treasure Chest and Copper Shell beginning to climb on the far side now and it's Brown Lad and Artala going head and head. All La Loire into third there. Pale Blue Jacket under Tony. McCoy, Ho Invader on the inside of Arctic Fancy, then from Silence Range as they clear the next, and then Sansuru. Uh, Cardinal Hill into about fourth or fifth place now. Sheepskin noseband, blue cap, followed by Joe Mack as they reach the top of the hill. It's Artala from All La Loire and Arctic Fancy. They're about to run down towards the final three flights. So at the top of the hill on the far side, Artar and all the Loire, one and two. The yellow jacket, Arctic Fancy, in the blue cap is Cardinal Hill getting closer. White cap is Joe Matt, the grey horse. Back in the midfield is the fly, but that's getting going now. And then we've got Brown Lad trying to recover from that mistake. Silence Reigns drops away, but it's all La Loire who takes command in the Citroën Supreme Novices Hurdle. And with two more flights of hurdles to jump, it's all La Loire. Martin Pipe, 22 winners at the festival so far. And Tony McCoy, nine, but looking behind hide because there come the big Irish Raiders with the white cap Joe Mack who's in third place too uh, uh, Cardinal Hill who's gone Cardinal Hill's out of the race but he's spread eagle them on the final turn there's all La Loire bought for a massive sum from France but he's doing the business in colossal style because it's all La Loire Tony McCoy clear by six to in second place Joe Mack at the final flight now and it's all La Loire who gets Piper McCoy off to an absolute Walker in the speed championship for novice hurdles. It's all Arlois, a French import, storming up the hill. 12 15 clear. He's going away with every stride. A most impressive win. And at the line, all Arlois streaks home from Joe Mack. And then we have Arctic Fancy in third. Colonel Jaeger runs on bravely up the hill with Royal Witch. And after that one came Ricardo and then Rathborn followed through by perfect venue and after perfect venue all gone and then we have Ortana and the trail and Charlie's include Brown Lad and also the German Raider Sansaru and Copper Shell and Ho Invader.